What it do, Revenger crew? What is the halves on the craps, man? Listen, this is your first time rocking with your boy on the channel. Welcome, man. I go by the name of Bo. Catch me on your Instagram activities and your TikTok activities at Merrill Productions. What we pride ourselves on at this channel, if this is your first time here, is we pride ourselves on delivering you the best music throughout the world. And tonight, that brings us to the homie Yeet, formerly known as Little Yeet, up out of Portland, Oregon, man. The homie got popping this year on TikTok. This song right here, sorry about that, actually has 3.6 million plays. So homie is popping. He's got cosigns from Lil Yachty and Drake per Wikipedia, where all that information is from. If you haven't already, man, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, become a Revenger crew member. I'm getting back to dropping videos every day, so I'm right here with my peoples. All right, without further ado, let's quit the yapping and start the snap, and let's check out the homie Yeet. My kids say Yeet, so initially, I'll be honest, I was automatically a little turned off by the whole thing, but uh, let's give the homie a chance. This is Yeet. Sorry about that. Hey, fool. Hey, go ahead, fool. I like this beat, though. Uh. Alright, so let's back it up a little bit. Let's look at what we got here. Got the Pinsky truck. Looks like that's a BM, maybe. It looks like a Z3, but I know that's probably a little old for this this all seems pretty low budget so i like it homie is 22 young young dude he looks young too i didn't even realize the song started i'm not gonna lie to you i had no idea we were actually getting into the song I'm gonna need y'all to help me tell me what he's talking about, cause I I didn't catch any of that. Let's let's back him on up. Ben, I don't know what that is, man. So this kind of sounds like typical youth music. I see why it's so popular. The beat is crazy. I think the beat uh probably. Is doing a lot, a lot of the the groundwork here. So we got the whole uh, kind of kind of Cardi, kind of Yachty, kind of, and that's why I think they might have got the cosigns. It, it sounds okay though. I'm not mad at it. And see, the one thing I get a homie credit for too is like. It's important to make music that sounds different. This sounds different. I say on my show every Saturday night, it's 8 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Got to plug it. Um, I say on my show every week is like you got to be interesting. You got to you got to be different. You can't just show up like every other dude out there. I don't know that I love this, but he's definitely different. I'm on a personal. I call up my bed like what's up? With you she said, can I? I'm, he said, I'm on that program. I call up my bed like what's up? I mean, I kind of like that. Like the delivery is kind of interesting. With you she said, can I? Like an I pull up, I say I'm with that. It kind of feels like he's talking. I don't know if he's freestyling. All my little Yeet fans out there, let me know. Is the homie freestyling right now? Watch a movie if y'all get a big star. She said she need a big old booty, call her Bob the Builder. Like in what I miss. Need that big old booty, call that Bob the Builder. I ain't mad at that. I also feel like you got to be under a significant amount of drugs to rap like this. I hope I'm wrong. I hope the homie's not all pilled out and stuff. But I do feel like to achieve the kind of sound he's getting, you probably couldn't be sober. I'm colorblind. They told me that I murder every beat like Columbine. Sorry about that. Murder every beat like Columbine. And then he apologized about it. I like that. Murder every beat like Columbine. Sorry about that. I, I, I kind of like that. That's kind of cool that he apologized for it in the same breath. I got to like that. Sorry about that. Oh, I had to switch the side. All my diamond flower, listen big, look at the size. I can easily see why this is popping on TikTok as well. I can easily see this. This feels TikTok ready. I'm sorry for your kid. That's just your life. What make you cry? Yeah, I'm finna tell you everything. I don't be shy. Yeah, I'm bad about winning. Rain for tonight. Yeah. 
I think this needs a feature, though. I can't even lie to y'all, man. I got to keep it a buck. That's what I do. I'm getting a little bored, man. Homie's okay. You know, it's just I'm a, I'm a lyricist at heart. I come from I come from the era of bars, man. So this isn't, uh, you know, it, it sits a little funny with me. You know, it can use another rapper. I don't think I don't. I will say, though, I don't think it's necessarily bad. It's not for me, but I wouldn't say it's bad. And that's that young thug influence. And it's, it's grown on me over the years. I didn't love the young thug uh, high pitch everything, but it's grown on me over the years. That dude, they're ugly. I like how he manipulates the words and he manipulates his vocals, you know, up and down, high pitch, low pitch. So he's got a lot of, he's got a lot of, he's got a multifaceted kind of approach to how he puts the songs together. I appreciate that. I'm not, I'm not mad at this, homie, man. What other songs from Yeet do y'all like, man? Hit me in the comments below. Let me know. Was he popping a pill during the video? That's extreme. What's Benny Bachi? I, I don't know what that is. Yeah, my only problem is I can't understand everything he's saying. I need the lyrics. I think if I had the lyrics, I might be a little bit more interested in it. Need a lyric video from the homie. I and he's mentioned his drug addiction like three times already. Bro, we get it. And see, this is what I need from the youth, man. Like... You got to be a little bit more inventive, man. It can't just be drugs and parties all the time. And I know I sound like the old head. I am the old head, man. But I'm just saying, like, I'm not mad at you for partying. But, like, come on, man. There's got to be more tea than your drugs. I just got out my mind. Like, there's another style change he did with. And I really appreciate that about the homie, man. He's changing up his style a lot, man. Everything is, every other joint he says, is, it sounds different every time. And, you know, I don't know a lot of rappers that do that. I don't know a lot of rappers that have that many different cadences and that many different unique flows. I mean, obviously, you think off the top is Lil Wayne. You know what I mean? But, like, most people aren't that varied with their flow. So I got to give homie a lot of credit. He's got a lot of original delivery. I just got out of on my jewel. But I like that. Now is that the hook? Cause I heard he just repeated a line. Pull, pull up, uh, I'm pull up on the perk and I, I'm on the perk and I call up my girl. Like, what's up? Which uh, and see that's that delivery. I do like, I do like the way he manipulates the words and stuff. She said, Can I? It's not it's not a bad song, man. It's not a bad song by any stretch of the imagination. We're gonna let it play out, man. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap the video up while it plays. I thought it was I thought it was decent, man. I thought it was decent. I don't think that I think the dude definitely has some original deliveries. The video's getting interesting. So the video was super basic, by the way, but that was that was kind of fascinating. That made me wanna like like some toxic sludge came from out of nowhere. That was kinda dope. Let me see what that was about. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Is that off the Columbine line? Is sorry about that? Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Sorry. And she need a big old booty color butter. The builder. What that means, I'm colorblind. They told me that I'm murdered. Oh, so that is the hook. Okay. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Now, if you kept that hook and you brought in another rapper, this would be a dope song to have a remix on. I do like dude's music, man. I do think that he's talented. I do think that, like, he's he's bringing something different to the game for sure. And I think his delivery is definitely one of the most unique parts of what he does. My thing is, though, I need I need more than just the one topic on the song, man. I, and if this is a freestyle, this could be a freestyle. If this is a freestyle, that's, that's a really good freestyle. Like, you really turned a freestyle into a song, and I respect that. 
uh, if that's what that was. But from my own perspective, I just want some more creativity and hilarious. I love the, the 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 multifaceted deliveries. I don't know nobody doing that. Big shouts to Yeet, man. That's Yeet out of Portland, Oregon. Uh, I think he just dropped the tape or something. I want to plug the homie just because that's how we do. We try to show love. Uh, I think his latest joint. Um, oh, he just signed the Interscope. So big shouts to the homie. 22 years old, getting money. I like it. Latest mixtape dropped in April of last year. That was uh, Alive. So he's going to be getting busy, man. Keep an eye out for, for Yeet, the homie, man. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give this song and this video combined probably about an 86 out of 100. Um, if it was just a song alone, it'd probably be closer to like an 82, 84. I didn't, I didn't love it. But I think if you pair him with the right artist, he can be really exciting. I also see him bringing a different style to the game. Just the way he presented the song with like four or five, maybe even six different delivery types, different flows and cadences. I think he could go a long way with that. So I definitely want to hear more of the Yeet music, man. Let me know in the comments below what Yeet songs you like, and I'll go ahead and I'll check them out and do a reaction for you. Subscribe to the channel. Join us on Saturday night, 8 o'clock Mountain Standard Time. We review your music for the ESMR Hour, man. I'll see you on the next video.